evening to everyone tuning in and welcome to match number two of the Singapore Tri-Nations T20i brought to you by Instagram. We're coming to you live from the Indian Association here in Singapore. Nepal, not much time to rest. They're back on the field, back-to-back -back games. And for the first time, we have the host Singapore here taking centre field as well. I have the men who matter, the two captains. For the very first time, Tim Davids, the captain of Singapore. And I also have Paras Katka, the captain of Nepal, and the match referee, Mr. Narayanan, as well from India. Gentlemen, we're ready to roll. It's going to be Tim to toss the coin. Tails is the call, Tails the call from Paras. And heads it is. So Tim wins his first toss. Tim, what are you going to do? Uh, we're going to bat. Uh, you arrived just late last evening. Did you get a chance to look at what happened in the first game? Uh, yeah, some of the boys were watching on the live stream, so it was a good game last night. We're looking forward to playing well. You all, the last time you all played Nepal, you all ended up smiling at the end of the game. You would love to continue that form. Yeah, of course. Nepal are a good team and we played well last time here at the Indian Association, so it would be good to do that again. And talk to me about this new role that you have. You must be pretty excited. Yeah, it's a good opportunity to captain the side. Um, pretty familiar with the boys now and a good team, so it, yeah, it should be good fun. And how do you expect this pitch to play, Tim? You've obviously known these conditions very well. Talk to us about what you think will happen today. Um, yeah, I think it'll be pretty similar for both sides, but uh, probably skiddy with the new ball and might spin a bit later. Go well. Thank you very much. Cheers. Paras, you don't mind bowling first? Yeah, I mean, see, it, it's just a matter of going out there and putting your heads down now and just, uh, you know, risking them to as low a score as possible. And it, it'll be good for us, I think, to, you know, chase the score down. It was still a pretty decent performance by your team with the ball yesterday and you'd like to continue that in some aspect for sure today. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, but uh, like like I said, uh, although we were good in patches, uh, we have you have to finish the game. So uh, hopefully we can, you know, come up with a clinical performance than yesterday. Are you playing a different side today? We just have one change. Uh, we have uh, uh, Sandeep Zora goes out and we have Susan Bahari uh, coming in. All the best, Paras. Thank you. Cheers. There you go. Captain Tin Davids wins the toss. For the very first time as captain and Singapore will elect to bat first. Be a good encounter. In the air. And doesn't quite carry to the captain. P3 deliveries. This could just run over to the boundary. Yes, the first boundary. Again, looking for Richmond Mutambami led from the front for Zimbabwe. An opportunity here. Is this the first wicket? A valiant effort at point there. Flat batted swat over covers by the Singapore Cricket Association to make this tournament happen. There's an appeal. It looks like it's out. Yes. And Rohan's making the long walk back. Again, looking to go over that onside field. And it's actually gone for four. Lions, they're thinking, those are going to be four very difficult overs to get through. Let's try and get as many as we can off the other bowlers. Beautifully driven. Very ordinary effort on the field there. Straight through, quick to get to the ball and even quicker to release. Shot. Outside off, and he makes enough contact to get himself another boundary. With square leg and third man. Deep backwards come up now, and the sweep has gone back on the offside because of that shot. This time, bang, straight back over the bowler's head. And, uh, welcome to this game today where, um, yeah, great shot there. Timothy. Absolutely. Direct it again, and this could be trouble. Um. Bang. Good shot. He'll find the boundary at extra cover. Oh, steps out. Big. How big? He's, it's out of here. Goes again. Has he got it? It's out of here again. Timothy Head done much as well yes definitely obviously um 
you know, you've got to put something on it to be able to get something out of it on this type of wicket. Um, it's the type of wicket that you've got to go bowl back of a length pretty quick and, and really give it a good rip. So uh, ju just to be able to think, um, you know, he's obviously very accurate and he can change of pace. Having said that, guess what? Tim Davis. Up goes the umpire's finger. Sweep shot. And a good sweep shot. He had to make sure that he got made so far of the way Singapore have been batting. As that is... Has that gone all the way? No, it's a four. Oh, that's just got... Can he continue this big hitting that we've seen so far? Just the one. Oh, it's a misfield. Not something that you want to be seeing from a Nepali perspective. And he gets it. Tim David with the half century. Reverse there, it's gone all the way for four. Bit of a high. Absolutely. When you come out to bed, it just gives you that little bit of extra oomph. Good finish to the innings, guys. Crashed and four. A 50 mark. It's just a psychological barrier, that isn't it? Bang. Oh, that was there. Again. To be hit. Oh, it's another misfield. Will it won't quite get to the boundary, though. Been a few of these. There we go. He hits it and he walks off. Oh, that was close, wasn't it? It's going to end up being a four. Made a little a few adjustments just now, Janet Prakash. Oh, beautiful. That's got to go. He does. What a ball. A few more singles and doubles in between those boundaries they're looking for. That's he nicely played. Just himself beautiful. But he can still manage to get something out of this. Well, and he does. Try to premeditate. Yeah, he's he's a man who looks like he's under pressure, but that will help his cause. Just about kept that in. Disappointed with that misfield. Mm. Ball's gone straight to him. Just watch this ball here. Well played through mid wicket. Probably pick up. Fantastic Good. piece of fielding there at the boundary line on the leg side. Certainly saved his team for the uh, SCA junior girls squad. That's a great shot to mid wicket. Wide outside off, and Arif will be people sending goodwill messages to the team for the upcoming series. That the great shot, and uh, you know they probably learned from that match as well how to pace the, the particularly the game, the wicket. Krishna in the game. Paros once again. That's Is there a chance here? Falls right in between three fielders. Well, good contact this time. Six runs. Short straight boundaries. Now that the skipper may well think to turn back to some seam bowling. Where's that gone? Ball. Sell it all back in for his last ball of the over. Hitting the square. And he's found the bounce. He's pierced the, the half chance. But it Good. seems all too easy there. Four runs, I think, is it? Where's that Big gun? one! Take that! Six more from Paraskatka! Six more once again! Nice shot. Thanks to perfection. Huge. Is it gone? Chance. He's dropped him. Dropped him. 
Big heave ho. And he's going to get four. There's two men back on the left. Somebody else comes in and does that for you. That uh, crucial stage is shot over extra cover. Again, taking advantage of... Going once again, uh, goes over long on, six more. Well, it continues, doesn't it? It doesn't matter, like I said. It's gone. Four more. Well, he's going to make things a little more interesting at it now. Here we go. There you go, big one. Century for Paris Katka. Up comes the bat from the captain of Nepal. And boy, oh boy, has he sent a statement to Singapore. We knew it the second he stepped onto. What are the changes that he will need to be doing? Because they're up against a confident-looking Zimbabwe team tomorrow. And that is a boundary, and that will be it, ladies and gentlemen.